Welcome back to Character Select. Coming for you, buddy. Oh, Jesus Christ, that's a 20 cannon shot. Oh, you hit And you went right into it. I kind of had to. Oh, your I poor sails. I'm also smoking. I don't know if you've noticed that. You're smoking. Gar. It's very rare to find two top pirates back to back like this. I don't know if this is a good thing that I'm doing, but we're gonna try it. Nope. Duck. Smack. Jump. Smack. Oh, shit. Gotcha. Okay. Get him. Get him. The advantage bar is based on how well I'm fighting. If it gets too low, then my guys start to die, and if too many of my guys die, then we lose. But I won! You know, he was so close, you would have think he would have seen that happen to Jean Lafitte, and <laughs> smartened up. You'd think. <laughs> You'd think. Holy balls! We got like 3,000... No, wait. 3,400 gold! Done! Woo! The fifth most notorious pirate, Lolene, has come to an end. Holy balls, we are having a good cruise. So here's the dick thing that you can do in a pirate haven. Talk to the captain. Tell him that anybody really needs plundering. Uh, consult with the shipwright to repair your ships. This is optional, you don't have to do this one. And sail away, and immediately attack him. <laughs> it's super dickish. Well, it's a pirate eat pirate world, I guess. Well, I also have 27 crew to his 75, so I'm really getting down to brass tacks here. Bring me my brown pants. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. Ooh, you're down to 16. Bam. Careful. Bam. Oh. Bam! <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, 16 survivors. We did it! The only problem is, that the only reason to do this is because of the reputation boost. They rarely have anything worth actually plundering. And believe you me, a thousand gold pieces is not that much. But yeah, if you need to improve your relations with a with a port that or a country that's basically been trying to kill you for the last twenty minutes, then just raid some pirates by telling them to raid other people and then killing them. It works out well. All right, let's see if we can sail into Port of Pay. Hey, we've killed like three pirates. Can we get a captaincy? We totally can. And he gives us an estate of 350 acres on the Ooh. other side of town. Ooh la la! Okay, this is going to be super shallow, but she's only attractive. Mm. <laughs> Beautiful or better, baby. Oop, another part of the treasure map. In the vicinity of Margarita. But it doesn't give us any information on landmarks, so we can't... Well, except those ones, but it doesn't really help us yet. Oh, shit. Welcome aboard. Trade with the merchant. I'm just gonna get rid of a whole bunch of stuff. It's not like we paid for anything anyway. It's all free money. And we have enough food for 44 months. 20 months. <laughs> Alright, so... Ooh, triple hammocks. Triple hammocks are okay. Oh. We'll take those. Um, we will sell that one. Oh, great. It double-clicked, so I sold the ship by accident. Great. Thanks, game. Technically, I would think it would be your mouse. And not necessarily the game. Shh. Mm -hmm. The other important thing to remember about this game is that unless you amass a large amount of money... People will not want to sail forever. They want to actually spend it. So you can't just keep sailing forever. Your crew morale, as indicated by this little smiley face next to where it says 94 crew, will go down. But we're actually going to Havana and just kind of taking targets of opportunity along the way. 
Because we're looking for Baron Raimundo. Baron Raimundo. Evil. Evil Baron. Evil. Transporting a new governor. That's great. I'm assuming that the economy flourishes because he's got a whole bunch of money in his hull, but... Good old Jesuit missions. The Jesuits were originally in the in the original cut of the game. The Jesuits were originally supposed to improve your relations with any country or with any country that was not happy with you. But it was dummied out, and now they serve literally no purpose. <laughs> Which always makes me giggle. Wait, where is Havana? Um, in Cuba. Oh God, all the way up there. We're at Cuba. I want to go to Guantanamo. Actually, I don't. U.S. government, please don't send me the Guantanamo. I'm not a security threat, probably. What's a pirate's favorite doll, she said, trying to change the subject. Um... Barbie doll? Damn it! <laughs> Are you driving me nuts. Ugh... Why is this taking so long? We should be going faster than this. Thank you. Go fast. Are we going against the wind? No, we're too close to the coast. Ah. The game speeds up depending on how close you are to what it is you're trying to get to. Blade Cape. If you're too close to the coast, it speeds up so that you don't accidentally run right into it. Which is which is nice. Yep. Saint Ju Santa Juliana. Black Cape. God, are we almost at Havana? I'm really losing my shit here. Are you ready for some vacation? To get a little R and R? Oof. You're not getting better. You're going to the Florida Keys? I'm going to the Florida Keys. Let me take... Hey! I can take all of the stuff that you're carrying for you. Especially the fact that you only have 33 crew on a Spanish trade galleon. How many crew do you have? 76. <gasps> pew, 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 pew. Rapier. So you're going to slay them with their, your rapier wit? <laughs> My rapier wit. No, it doesn't work. Maybe if you, if you, you know, selected charm and wit. We could have split. Never mind. I'm just gonna stop. You should. It's probably for the best. And his arm's on fire. Yep. He set sail from St. Augustine two days ago. Okay. Mm. He had several dozen tons of goods. And just a little bit of food. Just a wee bit. Um. We're gonna sink that ship. Because I'm going to need my men. So where's St. Augustine? Florida. Oh, way up there? Okay. Oh. So he should be actually somewhere around here. He might be still a little bit farther up the Florida coast. Yeah. So we're going to Camp Havana. Because it's a wealthy Spanish capital. I was going to say ooh la la, but that's, that's French. Let's talk to the governor. In Hey, now we're a major in this area. Ooh! And we got 150 acres. Alright, so let's get rid of all of the stuff we don't need, like the several dozen tons of food that's going to last us a year. We're not going to be sailing for a year. And we can sell the Devreed. What? How much... 40 tons? It only holds 40 tons? Fine, whatever. I don't care. 16 tons of food is more than enough. So if we were to divide the plunder right now, we everybody would take a small fortune of 104 gold. But we don't want to do that yet. Ooh, another part of the map? Ooh! St. Barnabas? I'm not sure what Barnabas is. Okay. We'll look at our map. We're going to need all 59 of you. And what does the barmaid say? Strike your panties and prepare to be boarded, lassie. Wow. I'm offended. 
set sail 16 days ago. Alright. So next time on Character Select, we're going to fight the evil Baron Raimundo. He knows where our sister is. We want her back.